In this video, I'm going to walk through installing BrainTool, importing bookmarks, and organizing them. You can see here I'm on the web store. I'm going to click Add to Brave. Uh, the process will work the same with Edge or the Chrome browser. I'm asked for the absolute minimal permissions, and then BrainTool installs. You'll also be passed to the BrainTool welcome page, which is worth skimming before you go any further at this point. As you're prompted to do on the welcome page, you should pin the Brain Tool icon and then click it to get started. You'll be welcomed again with a little bit of orientation and when you proceed, the Brain Tool Topic Manager is launched in a separate window. We want to keep the focus on your data, so the Options, Actions, and Info panel is folded away after you've been given a little teaser so that you know that it's there tucked away in the top left. Third, welcome, 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 welcome. And now I've given you a set of action items to, uh, to do to get started. Your brain tool data is organized as a set of nested topics. A topic can be any kind of category or organizational scheme that you want, but I've given you uh, an example to give you the idea. This is just one way you might want to save the kinds of things that you bookmark. Uh, categories of projects, um, other areas of your life, non-project areas, things you need to keep track of, uh, read later list, stuff that you just want to get off your screen and get back to later, and then uh, more general resources of, of, all, of any kind. Okay, congratulations, we've done our first task. Uh, so I can go mark it as done. If I click the to do again, it'll uh, take away the to do or done indication altogether, or in this case, probably what I want to do is just delete the item. Moving on, now that we've got the lay of the land, we'll go import our bookmarks. After we've granted permission, they're just slurped right in. You can see that like most people, I've got a bit of a semi-organized mess here, but don't worry, we'll deal with it. So there's a lot of different ways you can go about this. The simplest is probably just to click through on the link, have a look at the page, see what it is, and uh, in the bookmarker you can update its title and note, and then drop back to the topic manager to move it into its appropriate topic. Same with this one. I don't have a topic created for my brain tool project yet, so I'll do that now. I'll create it down here under bookmarks for the time being to make it easier to drag and drop things into place. This next few are a set of brain tool related subreddits. I check them on a daily basis, so I'll create a check daily topic under the brain tool project and then uh, move them into place. May be hard to tell in the video, but in this case, I'm using the keyboard commands to select each item and then use Option or Alt up arrow to move it into place. Ditto for this next group, which are a set of contributions that I want to acknowledge. So again, I create an appropriate subtopic under Brain Tool, and then use the keyboard to move those links or bookmarks into place. And finally, grab this last uh, Reddit subreddit that I missed last time around. I'll do a little cleanup, getting rid of stuff I no longer care about, and also move this whole uh, bookmark subfolder into place. At this point, I've made some good progress organizing my brain tool related links, so I'll move it up here under the top level project topic and get rid of these old example ones that I don't need anymore. I'll do a little bit more filing of some bookmark folders I want to save under resources. Okay, we've made some good progress, but I think I'm going to call it a day for now. So I'll leave a note to myself and mark the bookmarks item here as a to-do. Now I can get rid of all these welcome items I no longer need and start using Brain Tool for real. Uh, check out some of the other videos and blog posts and let me know how it's going.